What is up everybody, it's the Anime Watcher here and for today we're going to be continuing where we left off in Blue Archive's 4th volume, 2nd chapter, Rabbit of Kerbanog. Now in the last episode, uh, we met face to face with Kaya and it pretty much surprised me that Kaya didn't like imprison us or didn't, you know, um, do anything to us in general. She just tried to negotiate and when things didn't work out, she just let us go out. Well, we're not out. Right now, we're still going outside, so we're not entirely sure because um, <laughs> at the end of that negotiation, she did not like that. But I really like it because this just means Kaya isn't just a normal villain who's, oh, I'm bad because I'm bad. No, it's just that she has to be bad because she believes she's in the right. And, you know, she believes she can do better. She believes she can be... Um, like, you know, like, she's believing her own justice. That's what I'm trying to say here, and, um, yeah, I just can't wait to see how this plays out, because in this episode, we're going to be seeing Kaya first time, like, interacting to see, like, the public in Kivotos trying to fix DU and stuff like that. So it's gonna be interesting to see how she's gonna experience these and how she's gonna deal with them. So, yeah. This is a pretty long intro, but yeah, without further ado, let's just jump right into the video, shall we? Here we go. Episode 9, DU's New Dawn. The next morning in front of Kusagi Park. Okay, what's happening? Attention residents, a new executive order will go into effect at 12 a.m. today. Please visit the General Student Council website as well as your local administrative agency for further details. We look forward to your active cooperation in any future inspections by law enforcement. The General Student Council is not responsible for any harm or damages incurred from a failure to comply. Even the music is just ominous. <laughs> Once again, attention, residents, a new executive order will go into effect at 12 a.m. today. Is this really happening? I guess so. Although I don't even really know what this is. I already tried to read through the clauses on their stupid website, but it was so convoluted you can't tell what they're saying at all. Do, do you think Sensei's okay? We haven't heard from them since they went to the General Student Council building yesterday. Sensei will be okay. The new council's influence hasn't reached the Sanctum Tower as of yet. My biggest concern is what's happening all around the city right now. The announcements were alarming enough, but since this morning, I've seen a parade of armored transports and soldiers filling up the streets. There's no way it's another coop, is there? It's way too eerily quiet. We would have at least heard some shooting. It's hard to tell. We don't have any vision of the city from here. Miyako's gonna make a decision. Right now, information is our most essential resource. We'll have to do some recon in the field. Gear up, Rabbit Squad. Let's get to the bottom of this. Oh, oh jeez. So are we gonna... Wait. Oh, there we go. Well, Kaiser. Kaiser droids. Aren't those idiots Kaiser's special forces or whatever? Yeah, I recognize them. Why are they decked out in gear in the middle of the city? It's all civilian zones here. Attention citizens! As of today, security supervision of our 47 districts, including Kosagi Town, will be managed by Kaiser Security. In accordance with the Acting General Student Council President's will and the new executive order, Kaiser Security will ensure public order in Kivotos. We request the public's cooperation to ensure a seamless transition. Oh man, running so late. Why is the traffic light taking forever today? I'm gonna be late at this rate. Maybe I'll just go... Halt! Uh, um, me? Yes, you. Why are you trying to cross the street when the light is red? I was running late for my appointment and was rushing. I'm very sorry, can you give me a pass this one time? Rules apply to everyone equally. For violating the General Student Council's regulations and disrupting traffic, you will be charged with a th whoa, with a thousand yen penalty. A thousand yen ticket for jaywalking? I mean, I get jaywalking isn't cool, but that's way more than usual. 
Opposing the will of Acting General Student Council President? Unacceptable. You're under arrest for sedition. <laughs> this can't be happening. Oh, damn. Poor guy. Just wanted to get to work very early, but just couldn't. Now, how does this thing work again? Is it this button? What's that? Why is everyone crowding around this ATM? You there. Why are you loitering? Please bear with me. I'm an old man and not tech savvy withdrawing cash takes me a while sometimes just need to find the right button everyone is equal no exceptions all citizens deserve access to public utilities you must move once your allotted time has passed your selfish behavior has created a line oh, I can't even get cash these days damn you there What's in your hand? Oh, this? It's just a grenade. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I can understand the old man and uh, that guy jaywalking. This is way too much, a grenade. A kid holding a gr Oh, to be fair, there are students carrying guns and grenades and tanks running around. So, NPCs carrying stuff like these. It's just normal for them, but okay. Just a deadly explosive device that could destroy buildings and injure citizens with a mere toss? Are you a terrorist? Who is your target? Uh, hold up. Since when can we not carry grenades around? You wouldn't tell me I can carry my school books or water bottle, would you? I'm pretty sure grenades are listed in our supplies list. In accordance with the new executive orders, carrying explosives weighing over 100 grams within DU territory is illegal. You're under arrest for conspiracy to commit a terror attack. No way. That's absurd. Wow, it's just chaos everywhere. There are soldiers everywhere and they're arresting citizens left and right and center. And since when did it become illegal to carry grenades in the city? If that was a thing, I would have been arrested ages ago. Well, Moe, <laughs> the new, new executive just, you know, happened yesterday, so... You know, I should just stop. <laughs> it's all a part of that new executive order they issued. There's so many new rules and regulations. They could probably teach an entire class on it. The textbook would be huge. <clears throat> We're focusing on the wrong thing here. Since when is Kaiser Corporation in charge of policing the public? Shouldn't the whole lot of them behind bars after the last failed coup? Kaiser has more influence than we realize. I think... I can't stand seeing law enforcement intimidating and arresting citizens, or residents I mean. Even if it's in the name of crime prevention, that's not how justice should be upheld. But, but, you know, today does feel more orderly? On a typical day in Kivotos, you'd have some yahoos firing guns or trying to blow us up or the grenade launcher. Well, yes, that is a good point, but... <laughs> All the citizens, all the innocent people will get arrested for something they did not do. With such a threatening security presence, no one's fooling it. Well, no one's foolish enough to start anything. Why does this feel so wrong? Yes, yeah, because they're oppressing the people. Yes, there's no crime, but at the cost of, you know, innocent civilians getting caught up. Isn't this the ideal society? No one commits any crimes because the law reigns sovereign over the city. So why does it feel so ominous? Is this the justice I've envisioned all these years? No, no, Miyako, it's not. It is not. Oh, yo, it's the bum guy. Yo, chapter one. Oh, it's nice to see him again. I forgot his name, though, but I do recognize that silhouette to not know me. It is your first time beholding such greatness, I would assume. We are well known, <laughs> God damn it. famous even, among folks who pursue a lifestyle of minimalism and tranquility. You must have been living a life of extravagance to not know about us. <laughs> God damn it. I am Descartes. We are a collective of the poor who hope to live simply and honestly. We call ourselves the pursuers of non-possessive happiness. The pursuers, for short. The uh, pursuers? Exactly. And we aren't moochers of society. 
We chose this way of life to nourish our souls. Not working, not owning, not wanting. Interested? If you fancy our way of life, please. Bravo one, take this idiot away. Roger, roger. No, no, wait a minute. We haven't done anything wrong. If you're going to haul us away, you have to at least give a reason. Okay, here's your reason. Because he did nothing. You are all oh, whoa. Whoa, I was not expecting this droid to go hard. Damn. Um, this... <laughs> oh my god. You are cancerous. Parasites leeching off of society. You drain its resources and give nothing in return. For a thriving community, we need to... Reshape mindsets like yours. We're sending you to the Kaiser Corporation's employment facility to work. Time for you to contribute to society. No. You can't make me work! No! He's definitely me for real. <laughs> Excuse me. Even if the course of action you pursue is for the public good and safety, you cannot arrest citizens without a warrant. If you abuse your authority like this as a member of the SRT Academy, I have no choice but to intervene. You misunderstand. This is the will of the acting president. Am I to understand you are questioning her command? Even if you say it's her will? A weapon has one purpose and it's useless if it can't perform it. Oh, she remembered this. Okay. Anyway, which school are you from? I don't recognize your uniforms. The, the SRT Academy? SRT Academy? Eh, doesn't ring of it. any bells. Excuse me, are you trying to antagonize us? Saki, Saki, it's okay if they don't know. It just means we'll have to teach them who we are. One lesson at a time. <laughs> On top of that, you seem to have weapons that violate the new executive order. Hmm. You're being detained too! Drop your weapons and put your hands in the air! Rabbit 1, permission. Permission granted! On my signal! It's fine. I can handle this. Oh, it's, is, is it Yukino? It's a fox squad, isn't it? Oh, oh, it's this guy from Volume F as well. It's been a while, Rabbit Squad. General, from the recent attack on Charlie. You mean the one who nearly blew up a building during Operation Recapture Charlie? I'm honored my decision stood out enough in the minds of such elites as yourselves to be remembered. Don't get a big head about it. It's more like your refusal to accept defeat was so absurd that I couldn't help but remember you. <laughs> I suppose I'll have to take what I can get. I will admit I may have underestimated your squad back then. But unfortunately for you, I'm not too prideful to learn from my past mistakes. Why let us go? The odds were on your side in that situation. <laughs> As if those grunts would have stopped you. Regardless, I have orders. Direct orders from the Acting General Student Council President. In fact, to not antagonize the SRT Academy students. The Acting... From Defense Chief Kaya? Yes. It seems she's planning to reinstate the SRT Academy. Under her command this time. If that is true, we may not be allies, but we will be on the same side. I have no reason to fight you. She's going to... Reinstate SRT? There, there. Your complexion is pale. Do you need anything? Probiotics? Food? Okay, back off, back off, get back off, back off. Please, feel free to take advantage of Kaiser's services. You'll have access to whatever supplies you need at the Kaiser Express in front of the park. Granted, we can't openly give you outlawed weapons, but if you need something. Let's just say we can arrange something a little more discreet. Your offer sounds fine and dandy, but I know when something's too good to be true. What are you scheming behind the scenes? Your last plan to overthrow the General Student Council failed largely because of us. Surely you resent us. <laughs> Isn't that a given? I can't stand you, SRT. You have power most can only dream of and you squander it away on your shallow ideas of justice. Your misguided sense of righteousness almost cost me everything. 
the idea of taking each and every one of you down. It's incredibly appealing. <laughs> but sometimes society requires us to nice. It requires handshakes with trembling little rabbits. Personal vendettas mean nothing in the face of my greater goals. In that regard, President Kaya sets a good example. She'd collaborate with anyone as long as it furthered her goals. She proved as much when she extended her hand again after I betrayed her. The cooperation of two people who understand how to exploit the other's strengths is stronger than your paltry relationships. Things like comradeship, friendship, machinations of the weak. You believe in nothing then? I have my beliefs, but they don't dictate my missions. I follow orders regardless of my personal beliefs. That's what makes an ideal soldier. A proper special ops agent. Can you claim that? To me, you're strong but idealistic to a fault. Why need children? You're cowering prey who fight the injustices in front of you but turn your head at inequalities that don't affect you. So keep winning as many battles as you want but you won't be able to win this war. You don't have the resolve. Damn. They were silent. Let's head back everyone. We've collected more than enough intel. Please, feel free to accept some of Kaiser's free supplies on your way back. No thank you. I'm not naive enough to be in debt to someone like you. Not when I don't know what you're planning. Oh excellent. At least the leader has some amount of common sense. Until next time then. Damn, okay. Ugh, I can't believe we just got lambasted by the loser of all people. Something's wrong. What is it? Is there something on my face? No, about when he was taunting us earlier. You're usually a hot-headed idiot, so I was just waiting for your balloon to explode. But you actually kept your cool. Has our little Saki finally matured? There were soldiers with guns everywhere. It's not about maturity. I was trying to not get us killed. I would have liked to take that stupid general's face and... And, well, he was right about one thing. Dominating in battle won't help if those in charge... Oh, wait. If those in power change the rules every time they start losing. I mean, at the end of the day, we were made to follow orders. Uh, at SRT, they always said on the battlefield... Emotions are a distraction, and distractions means failure. So, I think it's time to address the elephant in the room. What's our next move, Miyako? Elephant? What do you mean? Don't play dumb. Yukino wants us to disband and become part of the Fox Squad. What do you want to do? I'm hesitant to disband SR- Oh, <laughs> God damn it! I'm hesitant to disband Rabbit Squad, but if the SRT Academy is really reopened, It'd be a little purposeless to continue protesting here. Then maybe being a good weapon and listening is our best option. I mean, how much longer are we going to live in a park? We can't keep scavenging for supplies forever. We have no way of making money and improving our situation. And I personally would much rather have a warm bed when winter hits. Uh, I'll do whatever you do, Miyako. Oh damn, okay, the pressure is now on Miyako then. Considering Chief Kaya promised to restore the SRT Academy, keeping up this barricade in the park is pointless. Joining our seniors would mean a structured life, better weapons, and a comfortable place to live for the whole squad. What matters more to me? Are these ideals I've dug my nails into since the moment I joined SRT just that? Ideals? Dreams? My squad members' struggles are what that matters. She's not gonna join it. Okay, listen up everyone. The episode ends here. Oh, never mind. I can't make a final decision without hearing from you first. Oh, okay, so the episode ends here. Okay. This is out of control. Wow, one episode only. Huh. And that is going to be it for today's episode, everyone. I hope you had a wonderful time watching the video. 
please leave a like hit the bell notification below so you'd be notified of when i would be live or when i would upload my next video oh by the way i'll be live in a few hours because i will watch to tomo oh, oh my god i will watch tomo's event so yeah i hope you guys have a wonderful day thanks for watching if you're still here happy birthday if today's your birthday and i'll be seeing you guys in the next episode see ya